going on guys it's your boy it's Kyle and we're back with another one today we're going to be reacting to Knox Hill One World Cypher featuring Mac Lethal, Dan Bull, Jaren Benton, Futuristic, Vin J and more I know I've seen some mod I know I've seen I think six seconds I've seen a few more but yeah without uh without further ado let's just check this out and see what they all got cooking and see how the cypher turned out Hold on, hold on, hold on, motherfucker. What up, what that up, clap what up, me world? Blinking. It's your boy, Steve Knight. Welcome in all y'all to the One World Cypher, where we're bringing attention back to what really matters in this shit, man. The art, the craft, the sound, the bars. That's why I'm here. That's why y'all are here. That's why y'all are here. Trying to yeah. keep this hip-hop shit alive. So y'all enjoy it, man. Let's get it. God Grizzly. Every rapper nowadays be acting in cloud chasing. I about facing this one here's for the creators that got done shady like that man who raised Haley. Half these niggas in a game that's making paper all bark. Y'all will support them deep down knowing they racist. Y'all in here faking like true pays and it's crazy. Fuck you, pay me. I learned that from Jay Z. I ain't about to just let y'all play me like y'all made me. Trying to play notorious. Thinking it's all gravy till you niggas get down face down and you ain't praying out the Allah. Bro, he, he came in hard. I'm not gonna lie, he came in hard. I was, I didn't know who was going first. I had no clue who was going first. But I like the message. I do like the message that you know Stevie was talking about in the beginning because I'm pretty sure he's talking about you know all the people who just are in this for money. You know, he's definitely trying to weed them out and get the people who actually care about, like he said, the craft and the art of this. Um, which I totally agree. I totally agree with 100%. But I'm going to take it back. I, I have heard Grizzy before. He, he's, he's dope. I'm going to take it back, though, because I was... I didn't... I wasn't expecting it. I wasn't expecting it. He got me caught right up, you know? Um, but his first bar that he said, you know, with the the rappers nowadays, they're fake and they're clout chasing. I'm pretty sure he said something like that. 100% true. 100% true. A lot of them will literally, you'll see like a hundred disses on whatever artist is big that week. You know what I mean? And that's just because that person, whoever dis is dissing, is trying to get the clout off of, you know, whoever's, whatever artist is doing big that week. Or you'll have, you'll have, uh, you know, clout chasing artists try and diss them on their day of their drop, you know? And it's like, it's just because they want the same clout that you know um but no yeah let me play this back let me play this back uh, get this uh right here let's, let's start this I grissy every rapper nowadays be acting in clout chasing I about facing this one here's for the creatives that got done shady like that man who raised Haley half these niggas in a game that's making paper all bark I like that's obviously a shout out to Eminem but talking about you know this one's for the people who don't really have the opportunity to, you know, whether it be because they're underrated or, you know, whatever it may be, but don't really have the opportunity to get their voice out there like some other artists that don't deserve to, you know, because they're bought and they're paying their way to have their voice be heard or whatever. You know what I mean? So I definitely, I, I like the way he's starting it. Done shady like that man who raised Haley half these niggas in a game that's making paper all bark. Y'all would support them deep. I like that. Paper, all bark, comes from tree. Uh, I like that. Damn, no one Y'all in here faking like true pays and it's crazy. Fuck you, pay me. I learned that from Jay-Z. Obviously, you know, that's a that's a simple bar right there. I ain't about to just let y'all play me like y'all made me trying to play notorious. Thinking it's all gravy till you niggas get down face down and you ain't praying out the Allah. Voila, magic without the lake is the way I'm making a statement and weaving the words together like phony hair. It's amazing that I'm trying to find my way. I'll niggas sleep this and awaken and I start bathing aping. It ain't nobody debating. It's your favorite rapper's favorite. Top five that are alive and I'm overstating it. King, you know the winner. I like that bot. It's your favorite rapper's favorite. Like that was that was a clean bot. I'm not gonna lie, that was clean as hell. Rapper's favorite, top five, dead or alive, and I'm overstating it. King, you know the one that y'all pretend to be. I'm not a guy, but the most highs what they'll consider me. Get it twisted, I roll up. Hold you, homie, no twist sweet. One beef, we bringing it to your door, but this ain't Uber Eats. No losing sleep. 
That was a clean bar. That was a clean bar. You know, I mean, it's DoorDash around where I am, but you know, I, I like the bar. I definitely like the bar. That was that was clean. You know, You're like you want beef? Well, I'm right at your door. You know, but. I ain't serving your food, you know, like, we gonna get it. I'm not a guy, but the most highs what they'll consider me. Get it twisted, I roll up. Hold you, homie, no switch to sweet. Won't beef, we bringing it to your door, but this ain't Uber Eats. No losing sleep, cause you say you beat me, her in your dreams. On my own, you try to play me, they probably count as dreams. Smooth criminal, lyrically, really, I just did the lane. You don't want smoke, and the flow always coming, the nigga, uh, but they beg the dip. Okay, yeah, okay. For running out from Twitter, all they do is bigger. One world that we live in, they careful get sunburn. When you hear me, this don't get a flag with the words of a gym in the side. Started from the bottom, working my way to the top so that I can pop. And I'm here with Knox and I know. Soda pop. I'm not political, flow is biblical, smoking no spiritual, hear it, you but hardly hear it, you nigga. Distribute for the ones who sell they soda, distribute niggas, always deliver, put in fear you niggas. How my sport? I want to say that's like the third time I've heard King Blitz. And it was all on ciphers. I want to say third, maybe second. I can't remember. But he definitely, he definitely came in with this one. I'm not gonna lie. He had some, he had some fire bars. His flow is nice. You know, to me, he definitely has that. I don't know why, but some, some artists you can just like, you get that underrated feel. You know what I mean? I'm not like he's dope, but I just get that like underrated feel when he, when he's just flowing. You know, I, I don't know. I, I kind of dig it. Here you nigga, distribute for the ones who sell they sold it, distribute niggas, always deliver, put in fear yeah. you niggas. How my sport at eight the yay and chase with ace of spade, why dark and strays from K's? I'm something that they should praise. You niggas a waste of space. Some bitches got basic traits. I just wanted my dick sucking that bacon skate. I told her to shake and bake. You niggas don't raise the stakes. Serrated blaze, I'm on a hunt for prey. When you a monster, monster, better run and pray. Greetings from the reaper, nigga. No mistake. The smell of death to make your stomach ache. It's so much trauma, I can concentrate. Been around the world. I Jaren is just dope as hell. You know, he is just, he's been around a while. He has been around a while. Like, Hobson, you know, like, when Hobson was kind of just coming out, Jaren had a few songs with him. Also, Tech 9 you know, like, Jaren's, Jaren's been around, and he, he's still got it. He's definitely still got it. Uh, him and Dizzy right? you know, like... Death to make your stomach ache is so much trauma I can't concentrate Been around the world, I sip liquor, I can't pronounce the Fucking high class bitches and slutty lingerie You know it's business when you see them killers congregate I mostly contemplate about family music and funds to make They ain't loyal, lost count of how many buns they break The bone collector come to collect, you better compensate The doctor told me that my brain ain't balanced I'm watching rappers fall off just like the milk crate challenge It's about resources that was that was a that was a hard bar. That, what was up with that milk crate challenge anyway? Like what the hell? They, the doctor told me that my brain ain't balanced. I'm watching rappers fall off just like the milk crate challenge. It's about resource and cash. None of this shit ain't talent. Nothing new under the sun. You see me saying patterns? Yes, it, it, that's exactly what it is nowadays. Exactly, it's about how much money you're willing to put into getting boosted, basically, like. You can have one of the best upcoming artists, right? But say he only has a thousand dollars to get started, and then you have one of the worst artists upcoming, but he has a million dollars to get started. Obviously, this one's gonna be up here way before this one. This one's gonna be grinding their ass, you know. It's it's sus nowadays, but I totally, totally agree. What's the cash? None of this shit ain't talent. Nothing new under the sun. You see me say patterns? The bully. I wish a thousand death upon the opposition. It's Mr. Big and tell these pussy niggas God is risen. Everyone should grow and be taught love from an infant. Everybody want to focus on the shit that make us different. So let's focus on what make us the same. Everybody breathe the same air, bleed red and suffer with pain. And everybody got their demons. We all get stressed. And everybody loses loved ones. We all meet death. Don't give a fuck if you're black, white, or you're Asian. A fuck religion, it just causes separation. What the fuck you wanna cause a divide? They wanna normalize murdering the person over nothing but pride. And what the fuck you wanna do? Okay, uh, DK, he has became, you know, an artist that I have really liked, especially his last cipher. I don't know if it was his last cipher, but the last cipher I heard him on, um, it was, yo, it, I, I even said it and. It was one of my favorite verses I've ever heard from him. You know, like, it, he was just talking some of the realest shit. But right here, he is also talking some of the realest shit. Like, he understands that everything is just trying to, 
you know, put differences on us. You know, they're trying to make us look at all the differences. They're trying to, you know, look at this. It's all about, you know, the news is all about differences. Look at this. It's all like this person, blah, blah, blah. It's, it's always bad. You know, it's never talking about, like he said, what we all have in common or the good things. You know what I mean? So I love how his verse is kind of turning around what life is about, you know, and focusing on the good and focusing what we all have in common and shit. Like, he's definitely becoming uh, an artist I definitely fuck with because he, he's he got some bad, mad bars and talent. I definitely like his flow, too. Like, I, I want to say I love his accent. I'm not going to lie. Like, I... I fuck with accents any any type of accent but the way he uses it in his flow it, it's just normal for him you know but the way he uses it, it it just sounds so clean what the fuck you want to call to divide they want to normalize murdering the person over nothing but pride and what the fuck you want to do with your life your time is priceless don't settle for just working at a nine or five and chase your dreams you can be whatever you want so pick a goal to chase and give it everything that you've got and if you fail you get fulfillment just from knowing you tried and you can live with no regrets till the day you die so i just got cold chills from the end of that that is a hundred percent true too like if you don't if you die without knowing you tried to get to where you wanted to be in life or, you know, you have a goal in life, right? If you die before you even even try the littlest bit to get to that goal, you're going to be just, like, you're going to live in regret, like he said, you know? But if you actually try and go 100% towards that goal, even if you do fail... You're not going to have any regrets because you actually worked towards that goal, you know? But failing's the worst thing that can happen, you know? And even then, you'll still feel that little bit of fulfillment, like he said. But that's the worst thing that can happen. The best thing that can happen is you succeed and you get to be where you want to be in life. So it doesn't hurt to try. That verse so far my favorite just because it was the realest you get fulfillment just from knowing you tried and you can live with no regrets till the day you die as well whoa. i brew intention been a year since the two was mentioned i paid the piper through my dues and now i'm due a pension my attitude is congruent with those who knew depression made it through it drew and relapsed and finally found redemption manifested this life nowadays my flight is booked i've been on my vices my grip is python i find a rook they pick a side but the snakes are sliding beside them to check the board for the highness is tightening and like the king of crook good chess scheme coming on the chess scheme coming on i like it i like it his voice is clean too i'm not gonna lie his voice is another one that's like you know when you hear a voice and you're just like yeah that's made for this type of flow this voice is made for i don't know why it just sounds so clean you know i've been on my vices my grip is piped on i find a rook they pick a side but the snakes are sliding beside them to check the board for the highness is tying in like the king of crook good versus evil my mind is a whole cathedral my one world is war torn i'm forced to forge a steeple form the form of me to a formula for the mortal people pour the more to have one foot and more to now my core is lethal that was sick that was sick I'm liking this. He's dope. He's dope. His wordplay is nasty. He's He's got some talent. I've heard... I want to say I've heard him on ciphers before. Two ciphers before, I believe. Maybe just one. I've definitely heard him before. But I want to say it was twice. But I, I think this is my favorite thing from him, if I'm going to be honest. That that was dope. For the mortal people, pour the more to have one foot and more to now my core is lethal. I'm at my core is lethal. I sing my soul in lethal. I went to heaven, stayed in corny as of angels equals. They sent me back, told me suicide ain't the answer, gadgets. So I let my hand relax the gap. All right, is this the sequel? Yo, yo. Yo. That was fire. That was fire. He definitely, yo. That, that was clean as hell. I was clean as hell. I'm gonna go back too, cause uh, he deserves it. He deserves it. This he was dope. My mind is a whole cathedral. My one world is war torn. I'm forced to forge a steeple. Form the form of me to a formula for the mortal people. Pour the more to have one foot and more to now my core is lethal. I'm at my core is lethal. I sing my soul in lethal. I w that right, I, that switch up, that change, just so clean, so effortlessly. Oh man. 
Nasty. Went to heaven, stayed in corny as of angels equals. They sent me back, told me suicide ain't the answer, Gats, and so I let my hand relax the gap harangue. Is this the sequel? Yo, yo, it's mass. Just another outcast rapping for the misfits and preaching to the people in the world that never fit in. Started as a hobby, but I turned it to a business. My music overseas, now it's spreading like a sickness. I never went to college, but I'm making more than you do. By writing music in my room and posting vids on YouTube. I've been making moves, I ain't asking for a handout. I'm building up the brand, all you other rappers stand down. I really do this, created a movement. I preach mental health with the words of my music. I work on myself, every day I'm improving. It's comfortable soothing, I step in the booth and put the- Not bad, I'm liking the flow, I'm liking the flow, and I like the intention. You know, I definitely like the intention, because you, know, you really don't see a lot of mental health rappers nowadays. If I'm gonna be a hundred percent, you really don't. So I haven't heard any of his music. I don't think. I'm not sure. But you really don't see many of them nowadays, you know. And I, I like to see it. So maybe. I mean, I haven't. I haven't heard anything in this verse so far about it. I've just heard him say that he does it, you know. So. I can't say that he does, but I'm willing to check it out. I work on myself. Every day I'm improving. It's comfortable soothing. I step in the booth and put the pen to pad again. I'm practicing my craft and then I'm passionate. We're rapping it. The flow is so immaculate. Dedicated Adam and I'm making a change. I won't stop this one world. We'll know my Yo, name. It's one love, one world. It's a beautiful life. Can put a dollar on it. Not a rain, a suitable price. Yeah, but lately I feel like we're losing our sight. Don't got no interest in the truth. We just consuming our hype. Said we really gotta change how we living We judging everybody by their race and their religion Gotta open up your mind if you're trying to make a difference I like it I li Just by that, just by those Those lines right there, 100% like it there's, there's not a doubt, you know Like, when you talk about the shit like that That's actually, that matters in the world, you know I'm there for it I'm there for it, you know, like people who recognize that we're fucking up as a as a world i love to hear it Love to hear it. No interest in the truth, we just consuming our hype. Said we really gotta change how we live in. We judging everybody by their race and their religion. Gotta open up your mind if you're trying to make a difference. Cause everybody talking, but nobody wanna listen. Wanna go the distance, we gotta come together and communicate. And try to see the bigger picture for the human race. Yeah, I know that. That's, yes, but nobody, you know, the bigger picture. See, the problem with that is everyone sees this and this. But the bigger picture is way really up here, you know? They're not looking at that. They're only looking at what they want to see. And that's, you just can't get it through to them. In the past, we made a few mistakes. But that's the only way to grow and then be truly great. Let's start with turning off the news. So we could be the ones creating our own views. Start living this life whatever way that we choose. And take what we learned and we can pass it to the youth. One world. I like him. I think... I think that might be the first time hearing him. I could be wrong. Uh, maybe I've heard him on a cipher. I, uh, they do. He does seem a little similar, but I like what he's rapping about in that verse, hundred percent. If the news is just horrible, I'm gonna just say that. Knox got in touch with me, invited me on his cipher, said I could decide on a topic and write what I like, but ideally get a deal with a real topic that unites us. But that's the fucking problem. Look, there's nothing in the slightest. Coronavirus saying it, climate change and violent games A fight for gay rights, race riot to colonize in space I could go on all night today just trying to name a time and place That might divide debate rather than inciting hate Every single issue we're divided into camps If someone's of a different mind to you then why give them a chance When you can fight with them online and we've been trying to get in camps Are we the psychopaths or sheep so I'm just silencing these lambs Now there were some people with being a doubtful seems just natural But even that's an opportunity to tackle these exact police Without them feeling like they're being attacked in heated battle Tongue policing, but you know the reason. Keep it factual. Lead by example, be respectful, clean and tactful, and they'll see the actual reason that you're speaking out for. And if you disagree with me, then that's cool. Now go and fucking kill yourself, you Yo, evil asshole. Day in <laughs> well, that verse switched. Like, wow. <laughs> oh, man. No, I definitely like what he was talking about. Um, his flow definitely, you know could be polished there's no doubt about that his flow could be polished 100 percent but 
like I said, I, I love the content of what he's talking about in there. I'm getting, that's like the whole, I mean, he did say that he, they, they hit him up and was like, write whatever you want, but I guarantee you, I'm getting the whole vibe of everyone was told, you know, a topic and they're coming in clutch with it, basically. They're doing, they're doing what the job ordered, you know? Um, but yeah, his flow was a little, a little off for me, at least, um, but other than that, definitely, I, li I like the verse. Me, then that's cool. Now go and fucking kill yourself, you Yo, evil asshole. another day, another black baby put into a casket, cause niggas wait. And get Him and the fridge. I'm telling, I've seen like four ciphers with this man in the fridge. And I'm all here for it, cause I love it. Issues getting badges, a militant mind, and they committing the crime in cells. They put us in cells, blood dripping inside. Got me walking with a hammer in hand. Things go left when the streets empty and no one got a camera in hand. They've been killing us, so I guess I'm going out fighting when they trying to meet a quota. I'm alone and it's the night shift world. Yeah, he, he's talking some real shit right here. He's, I was. Oh man, I was waiting for this. He, he's another one that I like that talks about some real ass shit that a lot of artists are scared to. There's no doubt about that. This right here, things go left when the street's empty and no one got a camera in hand. Like, I don't know if I'm interpreting that wrong, but to me that's literally talking about, well, after he's talking about the cops, so maybe it's, it's talking about, you know, how a lot of a lot of wrongdoing with the police has had has been happening you know and a lot of it isn't recorded a lot of it isn't you know on the news to be seen a lot of it goes unheard of you know maybe he's talking about that but to me it's like kind of speaking on how everyone nowadays has to be basically recorded doing good acts or recorded doing you know good things and when the cameras are off what are they doing they're being pieces of shit basically you know that, that i don't know if that's what he's talking about but that's exactly what came to my mind when he said that like 100 percent yeah I, i'm here for it i love it let me play it back just a little bit in mind that they committing the crime in cells they put us in cells blood dripping inside got me walking with a hammer in hand things go left when the streets empty and no one got a camera in hand they've been killing us so i guess i'm going out fighting when they trying to meet a quota i'm alone and it's the night shift world in a vice grip every day there's violence temperatures at the highest and then there's the fucking virus we fighting with our demons trying to find reason behind this while time keep ticking and there's no way to rewind it blinded to the rest of this world in dismay by the beefs and the changes when we cause it's decay do the greed for the dollar i guess i said everything i guess i got a problem with everything being an independent <laughs> oh man and that's the thing that's the thing it's all for money literally everything that's like it, it's it's for power and money you know and to get power you have to have lots of money basically so it's all money and that's the sad part about the world uh, I, I love how he ended that though. I, I, <laughs> I guess I said everything. So I fucking hate everything. I, I said know. everything. I guess I got a problem with everything. Being an independent artist is something I feel passion for. They wouldn't let me in the industry. I smashed the door. Fans clap and roar because I got raps galore. Can I just get what's mine? I'll never ask for more. I've never been greedy. I'm always grateful. But I want my piece of the fucking cake, though. I deserve it. I've never been perfect. I'm not an angel. I got here by working like every angle. I could find never rushing, stressing over time, never pressing. I just try to be impressive with my rhymes. Spit fresh, make this man, this man has been grinding. I cannot deny that. I don't think anyone can deny that fact. This man has been going, I, I think 2011, 2011 or 2012, wasn't that the year he did the look at me now with the pancakes, right? And even before that, he was grinding. Like, this man has been straight grinding, so you can't. You can't deny that fact. And I just try to be impressive with my rhymes. Spit fresh, make the song burn. Invest in the long term and start collecting every dime. Passive with the income, with passion over kick drums. You want money, you care about your craft, and you can get some. But if you 100%. If you don't care about your craft, who's going to care about it, you know? You have to be the one who cares about it most for other people to care about it, too. 
won't be doing it for the money, you'll be doing it for free. Cause if you don't care, then why the fuck should we? Exactly what I just fucking said. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Hey. Oh, she just goes. Okay, whose world? One in his mind up up on my nine nice shit. Spot trip, gone for the weekend. I'm with a fine chick, but nine drip, non existent, y'all. Hey, you can't be. You're having a kid. Isn't he? Didn't he just post about him having a kid? Right? You ain't with no. Unless you're talking about your wife, I mean, it could be, but. I don't know. Uh, no. I shit, spot trip, gone for the weekend, I'm with a fine chick, but nine drip, non-existent, y'all Amazon Prime shit, shine quick, diamonds is dancing like they was prime kids, five, six, but looking up to me, let me coach you up, don't gotta show you up, if I fuck with you, then I show you love, you know what's up, pop up with 20 deep, then you know what's up, I did it all myself, then expanded, you think I roll with Russ, Ugh. Shout out to Rut, I like it. Turn my state into a culture, brought some outsiders in and had to shoot down all the vultures. They were sleeping on the kid at homies' houses on the sofa, bunch of buns with Twitter fingers. Terminate them like the roaches, put your wifey on the coast because she went off the wood. They had the nerve to doubt the- Yo. That was a clean ass bar, I'm not gonna, yo. <laughs> Yo, I don't even, yo, that shit was just so clean. That shit had me crying, I'm not even gonna lie. Holy fuck, that shit was hilarious. I love bars like that. Oh, man. Put your wifey on the coast because she went off the wood. They had the nerve to doubt the kid. I always bet that I could. Confess when I should. I got him disrespectfully shook. I killed a person named Kareem and how I flex with the hook. L. Ooh, the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar hook. Nice. I'm hotter than the earth if we don't change our ways. Killing me is as possible as living off minimum wage. I could do consciousness like. Our two seconds not even into his verse, and he's coming in with some real ass shit. Like, <laughs> it's impossible, like, living off the minimum wage. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. I, this man's dope as fuck, though. I, I've been listening to him for a while, and. He's dope as hell. Killing me is as possible as living off minimum wage. I could do consciousness like the difference between sex and a rape, but I could go do trap like innocent blacks and must live in a cage. They just move with the money. Look how they budget. Government subjects can't be trusted. No one in it, no income. And tell us such and such is fucking on such and such. And we love it. Gossip topics, constant public corruption, distracting the kids. Now they crush. Dude, and uh, he he's talking about real shit. I mean, right now he is, but he, he usually is what I'm trying to say. And what I've heard from him talks about real shit you know kind of like six seconds how he talks about shit that other artists don't really speak upon he's another one and that right there is something I haven't really heard from another artist you know but it's 100% true you know with the magazines that you all read you know see now all over that's literally just distractions, you know? All the drama and shit on Facebook, Instagram, whatever, you know, like he said, so-and-so kissing on so-and-so probably was set up, you know, just for the drama, you know? Just to distract you, you know? It's it's all a scheme, and I love, I love how he's... Man. And on such and such and we love it Gossip topics, constant public corruption Distracting the kids, now they're crushing on celebrities And wanna be like them, so they dress up And nothing much, it sucks, the parents ain't guide them And then they see someone they age and then the DMs They slide and thought I was a child, but it's a pedophile That's using disguises Talking about everyday life Right here, cause this happens on a Regular, and it's so True It is so true, like a lot of parents Just don't after a certain age, they just stop. They, they stop giving a fuck, you know? And they're like, basically, raise yourselves. And then this shit happens. In the DMs, they slide and thought I was a child, but it's a pedophile that's using disguises. Ugh, that's not the kid's fault, that's just the world we live in. Like, humans ain't shit, but we blame it on religion. Innovations and alterations through generations, through different nations, and what I'm saying is we just fucked up everything that's written. Don't let suspicion run you from the truth. Don't blow it out of proportion like plastic surgeons do. I say what's real, so you <laughs> Blow it out of proportion, yeah. Fuck with me like I'm version proof. Somebody savage duality. Guess I merged the two. <laughs> Running the race. Yo, I'm 100%. 
some real ass shit right there was spoken. Like, Samad, I don't know. All of these guys are talking some real ass shit. I'm loving it. I am loving it. This is straight up my type of shit. <laughs> So face the pace that people pay for places in this race So stuck in a maze, what do I say? One and the same, they hate the way I say to change this nickel plates on 38s with numbers scraped I'm taking aim with K's to solve and spray As mathematics, feeling the static The baddest rap is added with savage on ad libs You finna do what? I'm death to the yapping like with it. <laughs> like a lap dance and lap lane, I'll finish you fucks. You finicky sluts, a gimmick as fuck. So just sit the fuck down and shut the fuck up. It's one world that they said they killing with this plastic shit. Recycle rappers in an ocean who have never been. You ain't 10 with the pin, no top comment on my YouTube that is top honest. Professor Knox, I ain't tripping, but I drop knowledge on you. Scholarship is sinking on my peers. I'm Titanic, stop them hovering the top phonics. I'm the illest mind. So hop sink some mint, some ink, some mint with penmanship like into wits. That was clean. I'm not gonna lie. That one was clean. The, these ones were kind of like real subtle, you know, uh, but that one, the Hobson one into the next flow right there, you know, that flow change up with it. That was, that was clean as hell. I do like his flow though. I will say his flow is clean. He's definitely got it shaped up right. There's no doubt about that. But that right there, that was probably my favorite part of his verse so far with the pin no top comment on my youtube that is top honest professor knox i ain't tripping but i drop knowledge on you scholarship is sinking on my peers and titanic stop them hovering the top phonics i'm the illest mom so hop sink some mint some ink some mint with penmanship ill mind of hobson like intuits, my intuition's cold. My aurora's book, reality, this go free mouth, this callous lead for a cut you like them trees in the Amazon. I'm in my prime, I'll put you in a pond. Heating up like glaciers melting in the Arctic. Come on, my arch. And a, well, I kind of caught that one late, but the tree bar with the pine is the casket. I kind of, uh, I was like thinking about it real quick, but. I got it. Cut you like them trees in the Amazon. I'm in my prime. I put you in a pond. Heating up like glaciers melting in the Arctic. I'm on my arc shit. No, I swim with the sharks. Dip my Noah's Ark. Uh, toes okay. in the tropics. I'm on my island shit. Do you equate to what? My attitude is on a latitude. Can't see me because I'm real with the thoughts. Y'all just make it up. Say enough to get your paper up. Raise the heat and chop your limbs for that paper cut. How can they see between the lines when they pay me? Chop your limbs for that paper cut. Basically saying you'll give your arm and a leg just to get a check. And that's true. With the bro brush. I'm on my way to my first meal. Now get the sawdust. dust. Don't mind me. My trail's in that. Okay, Sada, the sub bit. But I don't spit it. He's got some nice, nice wordplay. I was the first one, you know. The first couple were, like I said, they were kind of subtle, kind of, you know, simple. I'm gonna say, but like as I'm getting into this, he, he's got some nice wordplay. There's no doubt about that. Sal does. Don't mind me. My trail's NFT, but I don't spit in crypto or for that USD. I keep it real on my shirt like an NFT. Rob the banks and save the planet, man. It's time to go green. It's one world. I'm trying to nurture my seeds and rise above the pain, hunger, and greed. We on the same team. Cause no matter creed or color, it's the same when we bleed. It's one world, baby. Somebody could get up. You're in. And that, that's all it comes down to, really, is we are the same whether you like it or not. You know? I mean, obviously, we're not, but we're the same. We all bleed red. We all, you know, we all dream. You know, we all, it's, we're, we're all the same. We may not all dream, but you know what I'm saying. But shit, this was not what I was expecting. I love the topic. I definitely, we need more artists to speak about shit like this. This is the type of shit I'm saying that artists are afraid to talk about because I, I forgot who it was, but someone was saying in here, like, if you do start talking about this type of shit, you, you can get canceled nowadays, and it's 100% true. Or if you start speaking shit that's the truth about whatever and so-and-so or higher-ups, as I like to call them, get, get scared, you're going to be silenced. You, you might just end up in the 27 Club. Like, it, it's it's that bad. But with all that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I appreciate all the feedback and all the support. It really means a lot. If you're not subscribed already, please hit that sub button. It would really help me out. Please hit that notification bell to see when I upload. I try to upload at least five times a week. I hope you all have a beautiful day slash night. Much love and peace out.